here, pop out a bump on. I need this here. Uh, well, I'm gonna have to. Oh, dude, where's my thing at? Where's my. Uh, where's my. Uh, hey, oh, here it is. Because I'm gonna need proof. I'm gonna tell you something you're not gonna believe. I need proof. Hey, see my, uh, my phone. I'll put that there for a second. Before that, let me, before I put my glasses on, let me, uh, as you may or may not know, remember I told you before that I had my smoothie that I made, was it yesterday morning, you know, and it's thick, then I put some stuff in it, but I gotta, I wanna make it less thick, but you know, I love pure, organic, pure fruit, black cherry. Black cherry blended with, whoa, fluke red. Oh, this is not the same one as that. Whoa, let me, whoa, hey a second. Hold on. Da, 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 da. Uh, protein. Where is it? Oh, no. Ingredients. Organic black cherry juice from concentrate. That means it's water. That means it's got sugar. Man. Organic pear juice from. Da, 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 da. No, I, in New York, I had this black cherry juice that was pure. This is a disappointing, pointing thing. Disappointing. This, this, this. They dissed me a point. Anyway, so I use this just to. Uh, I could have. Should have tasted it before anyway. I should have known. Anyway, so I put my smoothie stuff that I made with a bunch of stuff. This is a thick smoothie. It's not a thick smoothie. But, um. Ah, oh, it's obsessed me with the whole. Oh, man, it upsets me. Anyway. So, so, so. so the thick smoothie gets less thick with the con anything you see says some concentrate you know that you know concentrate like you said but you have water and they probably can't put anything from concentrate still tastes good but it was sweet ah, whatever oh let's put on my glasses um I gotta put them whatever put my first glasses first I need sunglasses on first and, uh, oh, you move over here for a second. Well, I have to move the desk of the ADOS. I'm actually leaving Virginia a little earlier, a day earlier. So today I'm moving around. Oops, uh, today I'm moving around a lot. Because of the, now I take the Chinese bus up. But somehow, you know, I didn't book, I don't know what, I booked late. So they say when I try to book, this is not available, says so not available from the computer for a ticket up to, you know, for Thursday night when I was going there Friday morning. So I had to put like, for this afternoon, that was thing of cost me a little less, but that's not the point. The point is when this first started years ago, I, start, I started riding a bus years ago, and it was just Chinese and black people, you know, a little bit of black people and Chinese on the bus. Now there's like a lot of black people, some white people, right? And a little bit of Chinese. I think the Chinese would, I think they have little private buses that they, you know, ferry people to. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Anyway, the point is, so a lot of people are living places like Virginia, wherever they're living, right? And they're taking the Chinese bus back and forth. You know what I mean? That would cost less than even living someplace out in, say, Long Island or whatever, or Jersey, than to, to go back and, and, and forth on, on their private, on their buses. You know what I mean? So they can live down here where it's cheaper, or whatever have you. Go up, and may, maybe they're working like, you know, three days and off four days. Maybe they're working four days, off three days. So, and they can crash here, whatever. I don't know, whatever the thing is. Well, I know the place is obviously there, very popular. And naturally black anyway as far as black people I got to because we live at the bottom well <clears throat> anyway I'm gonna go off there let's move my grandmother's so when I move actually when I, when I move when I go the, the desk has to move to uh, St. Louis I'm probably just gonna take uh, the normal radio thing I'm probably gonna take uh, no my my aunt towel that sort of reminds me of like my not national like you know hotel hotel brother you know um uh, probably take my blue and white thing down here. This is like Ogun from um, from the um, I guess it's the uh, um, that would be the uh, Brazilian stream was from Condomble, I think. Well, maybe it's just an idea. Anyway, take that. Definitely gonna take my grandmother's magnifying glass. Why? Because I want to carry her spirit wherever I go. So she not that's gonna travel with me all over the world now. Because I want to take that need to take my grandmother's spirit wherever I go. Let me go here, Anthony's. 
uh, thing on the desktop here. Let's go to the list. <coughs> Excuse me. There's this article that came out from this cat. Uh, they may have mentioned it before. Uh, Robert Fire, I think it is. Um, anyway, so I uh, and 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 in this article, what they did, oh, come on, what he did was he basically listed. There's these there was these two guys from the Hillary Clinton campaign back in 2016. Now, yeah, and when she when Tulsi Gabbard jumped off their campaign and did what she did that principal thing. What they did it was one of those leaked emails that people overlook. You know, they basically wrote a list. Are you going to be a persona non grata to us? And what happens? They went to other things. One, one book from them, I think, at the time was was that um, that agency, CAA, the you know Creative Artists Agency, or something like that. That's all the big Hollywood stars and all that being hooked up with them. Right? This is why you can't concentrate power. Anyway. So there so was a, some, a black guy was with him. So it's a black guy, white guy. A little diversity for you, with white guys anyway. Well, let's say the black guy is a white guy. You know how we got, you know how they, man, after all these years, they done went through the process, process, process. And so from, they say, hey, it looks like a black guy, but he's really from concentrate. You know what I'm saying? Because he, he's watered down. So he's he's against, you know, so, so, so what happened was they, they, they in this email, they said, you know, they, they threatened, threatened. Then this guy did some digging. And in the email, he found out the clients now. So now you have these clients. And if you wonder why all these late night shows always have the same people, or the new shows always have the same people, and you get other people on it because they all from these, this other guy has this other agency now. When is this another agency? What's it called? It's uh, uh, from the UTA clients, the UTA agency. I don't know what that is. Anyway. So between the two, right, who still have a whole grudge, a grudge against Tulsi Gabbard, they have these lit clients list. Now check this out. Let me take some sorry, read. Okay, now check this list out. No, this is part of this. Michael Moore's on this. Why do you keep on hearing from Michael Moore? You know what I mean? You know, Michael Moore, Malcolm Turnbull, Matt somebody, Matt, another, a Max somebody, the Jim Acosta, Jeffrey Tubin, uh, Jake Tapper, uh, Harold Ford Jr. You know Harold Ford, my guy. I mean, white guy, black, and one of the, one of the one of the from concentrates guy. Okay, maybe he isn't. Maybe he's changed. I don't know. Uh, John Cornish, uh, Gloria, somebody, George Takai. You know the actor. The actor, you know. Let's call him the activist for you know the the guy. Why is why the what the old the old guy? You know you know the the Star Wars guy. Don Lemon, Don Lemon, Don Lemon. Uh, Dan Harris, Chet, somebody, Diane, whoever, Diane. Uh, she must be somebody and she says, let me take that can be better without this yeah. uh, Clint somebody Chuck Todd Chuck Todd I remember when Chuck Todd started man you know he just had the, and they kept on pumping him up because he was just in the field or something like that oh you're doing excellent then they elevate him to now he's whatever he is but he, he was incompetent then so he's still incompetent now they keep... okay let me just say something let me just say something I have a degree in communications for Livingston College, part of Rutgers University, right? Well, Rutgers University, that's my degree, that's what it says, right? And when I was graduating, this was like in uh, 1976, when I graduated. Um, <coughs> one of the things that that that, uh, that people asked me because I fit this sort of profile, uh, young, black, good looking, okay, make like I'm good looking for some of you people, don't believe it, right? And at the same time, the other guy, same thing, right? And we were, we were about to become what we call buppies. But people asked me when I graduated, you know, what, what was it? Oh, oh my, am I going to go, because it's communication, am I going to, you know, it's just, they knew there was going to get black people in there. Am I going to go to, you know, play as ruckus, you know what I mean? So, you know, I got all the all the background, whatever happened. They said, well, are you going to ABC or NBC or CBS? I said, no. I said, it's not, no, no, so I'm, I'm, actually, I was going back to theater. We all, that's a whole nother story. Uh, and I ended up community radio. When I was in community radio, I made sure that I stayed in that. I didn't want to go to this other level. Luckily for me, another cat, you know, Ron McGee, peace and blessing on his eternal soul, he had the same profile, same height, same dark, same skin color, blah, blah, blah. He went that route. He ended up with NBC. When, you know, in fact, they, you, you start a small market, then you go to a medium market, then you go to a big market. So he ended up back in New York. I ended up in New York with BAI. He ended up in New York with NBC. But he quit NBC. Why? Because of the reason I gave back then. I didn't want to be in a situation where I knew that I would, that I would, um, I could only advance to their level of mediocrity. Profound. 
And these kind of things that happen to me, I'm, I'm, I'm on this whole weird, different trip. You know what I mean? I, it's not, okay, it doesn't matter. But the point is, I was right. And or if I didn't have Ron going the same tr track, I would, I would, I was right and I was proven right, right? And this happened to me in a whole lot of different areas. So it's really interesting. So I'm just trying to say these people that elevate to the whatever, 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 they're not all at what they stay are. They are, they are. they are mediocre at best, at best. Who else would I? Chuck Tuck, uh, Cenk Uger. I don't fight Cenk. I don't trust him. He sounded like a Republican to me. I just, the old time Republican, I just don't trust that guy. I think that the whole TYT crowd, I think they're all auditioning for Chuck Todd's spot. Let me put it that way. I'm going to leave it at that. Ben Shapiro. Uh, isn't that some weird, some whatever he is. Uh, Anna Kasparian. I think, is that Kasparian? Yeah, that's the same one with the whoop, with the, um, with that crowd. And the other big time uh, industry, you have people like Whoopi Bo Goldberg, Van Jones. I met Van one time. When he was working with, when he was with um, um, the, the project, you know, the, um, the Joseph, Ella, Joseph Baker Center, because I had some, I have, I have this whole thing I did when Ella Baker passed. You know what I mean? I did whole whole series, a whole thing on her funeral. I got those tapes someplace. I got to talk to Melvin, you know. And I was going to give him, give him the tapes to give to the Ella Baker Center. Maybe I'll still be able to do that. Anyway, so I should. That's Van Jones. He's a nice enough guy, tall, nice enough guy, right? But he turned out to be what he turned out to be, right? Valerie Jarrett, you know her, Susan Wright. Those are the two, you know, black people, black women, you know, from Concentrate. <laughs> Stephen Colbert, you know, S S Stephanie Rule, whoever that is, right? Seth MacFarlane, Rob Reiner, uh, Martha whoever, Mark Cuban, Kathy somebody too, the Joe Biden, Jimmy Fallon. Let's stop there for a second. Notice something here. We have Stephen Colbert, Steph McFarlane, Jimmy Fallon. What are all these? James Corden. Wait a second. Let's keep going. Wait, wait, wait. I forget. Jimmy Hill's on this list, too. Um, Ian Bremmer, right? Gail King. Da, 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 da. Let me stop. Let me, um, Elizabeth Vargas, Donna Brazil, David Kirshner, uh, David somebody else, Don FIFA, Connie Chung, da, da, da. Chris Cuomo, Carl Bernstein, Bob, Bob, Bob Woodward, Bob Schieffer, somebody, saw um, Bill Maher, um, uh, Bette Milder, Anna Navarro, somebody, somebody, Anderson Cooper, uh, Alyssa Milano, Anderson Cooper. Let's go back here. Let's go back here for a second. What does, I'm going to leave Chris Cuomo and Connie Chung and, 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 you know, and, and Bill Maher and, um, with Al and Donovan. I'm going to leave those people out of it. But what does James Gordon, Jimmy Fallon, Jimmy Fallon, Jimmy Fallon, um, Seth MacFarlane, Stephen Colbert, Stephen Colbert, all have in common. Ooh, they're your little late night white boy hosts. And they all in the same, they all come from the same agency. So when you book guests, if you want to, they all come, they have the same people coming through. It's a politician, they, they make the rounds in these shows. I smell, where's my, oh man. I gotta get back to South Africa. Where's my conspiracy act? Well, forget all that stuff. My point is, if you wonder why the, the, you, and Joe Biden's on the list, he's the only politician I see, well, big time. If you wonder why they say, oh, uh, so and so's leading this and the poll says that, because they're going to the same sources and they push the same thing. There's no earthly reason why Joe Biden should be. I'm calming down. There's no earthly reason why Joe Biden should be projected as blah, 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 blah. Well, oh, here's the earthly reason. You see what I'm saying? I don't, look, you all connected that. Bill Maher on the same list. All these people know each other. They actually know each other. Ain't that a shame? Put that there for a second. So, what does this tell you? You know? What does this tell you? It doesn't take a rocket science to figure this out. Okay? Let me move along because I know, I guess I'm, I'm, I'm changing things, you know, my backdrop here, this is, this is actually my apron back here. That my wife, you know, made this apron for me. She made this apron for me. So this is going to St. Louis too, it's part of, it's part of this. So my whole thing is changing. My whole thing is changing. I know my sister's going to pick that up because she doesn't let it ring long. I guess I was wrong. Um, so, um, this American flag, this set, this everything will stay here like that. 
Um, but I'll make new signs for St. Louis. Remember, I got to go to New York first, so I'll make a couple of reports from New York, right? No, so so that, that's happening. But let me tell you something else that happened to me yesterday. I had this revelation. It's like I've been traveling around. I get different, you know, things from different places, right? Now, yes, yes, uh, oh, here's, here's my nephew. Here's my nephew. He was, uh, I was babysitting last night. See, it's right there, little cutie, little cutie. And I got him. And then I had him. Little, made a little video of him like that. Like that. I'm sorry. I'm like a grand uncle. So what? Oh, look, 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 look. I'm sorry. Like a grand uncle. So what happens? You know, it's like grand uncles. We got to show off pictures and stuff like that. Uh, you know, pictures. So uh, let me go back to this thing right there, like that. But yesterday, here's a. I, I, we went fishing. You know. My sister and, and a fishing buddy, and then he, he's really good. He fishes all the time, you know, so I learned how to cast. I, I learned years ago, come on now, years ago, I'm city slick, okay, but, you know, if I, eventually I got it really good. You know, you got you to gotta sort of, you know, put, make sure the thing is right back in you and the weight is there, you know, start there. then you cast out. You got to have the follow-through. The follow-through is the thing. Whoosh, goes all out there. I started catching a little tiny fish and I wanted to use it as bait, but then... This, this idiot, not this idiot, but this thing got on the line. I got a few minutes. Where's this? Hey, where's this thing at? Oh. Oh, I got a few minutes. Oh, I can't see from that one. Ah. I'll show it, I'll show it here like this. I guess you can. Oh, you can see it here. A little bit. Caught a crab. That's a big one, though. This was a big sucker. Let me put this down. I mean, he like this big. I'm not exaggerating. No, you know, it was big like that. It was like uh, blue. You know what I mean? White and you know, and, and, and they had to put on icy, icy sort of anesthetizer. You know, when they say put somebody on, it chilled this boy out so he could. Cause you put your hand in there. Cause I come, I'm a cancerian. You know, so we got we pinch you. It's a military strategy too for for Ogun. You know. Anyway. No, Ogun Day is June 24th, which would make Ogun a cancer also. I'm perfectly Ogun. Anyway. I don't remember a little bit. But what I learned, because every place I go, especially in the States, they ask them not about AD, they ask them about the circumstance of black people. I asked them, I said, you know, what, what, how, black people don't, you know, go blah, 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 blah. And they say, you know, we just, just unless it's about money, they ain't showing up. Got to have, it ain't showing up lessons about money. So I think part of reparation, we got to get that money first so we can so or we can organize black people around money. You pay them to show up, you know, like, you know. It's like days when they used to have the um, the strike breakers, money, putting these people there. Hit, to show you what I mean, like they have this thing when you fish, you have to have, um, there's places you can't fish because the commercial people who had the money and did the politics, right, man, they make it so... You know, you, you the, the locals can't, you know, because if the locals start fishing, you know what I mean? Then that somehow affects, they think it affects them, they agree like that. But he was explaining to me that, like, in a bait shop, they'll have a sign, you know, just a meeting, blah, 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 dealing with this kind of issue, right? Now, in a bait shop, that's where you get your bait from. So when you're local like that, you 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 spend your money on a bait and beer. <laughs> the B and bait, the bait and beer, right? But that alone will... Hey, that alone was like what? You might be like eight hundred million dollars in that industry, you know, for bait and beer like that. But the commercial people will make, you know, uh, say billions of dollars like that. So, uh, but 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 black people, you know, they don't they don't count the young young little people as 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 part of the economy. It's too small peanuts for them. So you know, the sort of politicians, whatever, they get bored of. So one of the things we have to do is is. Convince black people, and that's something. Well, strategy. You gotta organize these for strategies. That when you come, when they have one of those meetings, you got some unemployed people. You got some people that say, "Hey, look, man, we're gonna we're gonna have a beer session. We're gonna we do do, do whatever." I know we're not some, uh, nearly full as Junior says, blah blah. But let's, let's leave them alone for now. To give, give five of your buddies to come to come to me. Now you know what they do at the meeting. There's some sort of sign up, and then they'll they won't pick you, right? But 
don't worry about it. You start five the next time. You say, hey, come on, and make it a thing where either you're you're messing with the white man. I don't know. Make it something so people come. You say, well, that might work. So so basically, you start packing these little meetings. So everybody thinks about just politic meetings, but this oh, well, that's a political meeting. But there are meetings in your own self interest in what you want to do. You see. Highest and crack addicts, you know. I'm serious. They still got they got drug problems out here. You know what I mean? Hey, you want blah blah blah? Come on, come to this meeting, and afterwards, you know, and let them nod out and meet. We don't care as long as the body show up. I'm sorry, I'm going a far afield now, but just had to say all that. Um, but there are ways to organize, and we have to start organizing um, because pff, it's just it ain't happening. This whole thing is just if just us talking at people and say do the right thing you know um now, well, our big thing now is that yeah you certain of us we can make sure that you know we support um uh, that whole uh, brief that, that antonio morris was talking about with, Bar with uh, um, byron allen yeah that's that's essential that should be you know you know that, that that's fine doesn't that's fine, okay? But the, so organize a regular black person on the ground, people, we got to have another strategy or other strategies. You know, I'm working on some stuff, but that's in my field, you know? Anyway, that's it for me. As I as we move the desk of the ADOS, it's moving on. We're going to another city, another place, doing some other things, learning some more stuff about the black people on the ground, what we really doing. That's right. Us, the, the, the American descendants of chattel slavery. That would be the uh, North American descendants of chattel slavery. Me being T from the Patterson's taking the trench to bed, letting you know where they only suspect from the ground. On the ground.